guys, welcome back. So today's video is going to be a demo slash first impression slash tutorial on the Clinique Chubby Stick Sculpting Contouring Stick. Just like that. So I wanted to test it out, like a cream versus a powder. So that is what I'm going to do. Use the Clinique stick on half my face and then the Too Faced bronzer on the other side of my face and just see if there really is like a difference between using a cream as opposed to a powder and also to see how the Clinique Chubby Stick works. So I'm just going to zoom right into my face and start this thing. One more thing before we get started. I am going to be using um, two different brushes. I'm using this brush for the cream contour because I was just told this was an easier way to buff it in. So we're going to try it. And then I want to use this, my, my regular bronzing brush for the powder. So let's get started. I feel like really up close and personal with you guys right now. And I'm going to move my hair out of the way. So I'm going to try the Clinique Chubby Zook. A little nervous, but... It is kind of dark, so I am slightly nervous, but I'm just going to do like a simple, like, you know, cheek, like the, I'm going to do like the three, the three effect, like cheek here, that. I already feel that's way too dark for me. So I'm going to blend it out using this, kind of exciting, but let's see how it goes. Okay, so that's my face, that's my face with cream, I guess you can see a bit of a difference, it does look a bit more sculpted. We're going to try the powder. So that's what it looks like side by side. I don't really know if you can tell a difference on camera, but I don't know. I do kind of find this is a little bit more sculpted. Definitely would recommend a brush like this for the cream contour because it, it does a really nice job buffing that in. Although I will say it does, it has like a slight orange tone to it, but I don't know, I kind of like it. I'm just going to like sculpt the rest of my face using the cream just to see what it's like. On my news. Sculpt this bad boy. Yeah, so if you are trying to sculpt your nose, it is a little tricky because it is so chubby. But I'm gonna do my neck too. Why not? Might as well go full out, right? Okay, so I think that's all you have to do. Okay, my nose just looks really weird. I actually really do like it. I can really see myself using this cream a lot more. So yeah, that is my finished face. So I don't know, can you guys tell a difference? Too fair skin to even like tell a difference. <laughs> but I'm gonna put on my blush and stuff and then I'll get back to you. Hey, new location. Um, I just wanted to see like in a different lighting if you can really tell a difference. This is the powder side. That's the cream side. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe they do both look the same. 
and I'm so happy with the cream contour. Okay, so that's my little review and demo. So my overall thoughts, um, I definitely like this. It is quite easy to blend out if you have the right brush. The one that I used is from Quo, which I think is Canadian only. But if you want a brush that's similar to this, there is a Sephora one, number 57. Yeah, I kind of, I think I prefer the cream over the powder. I feel like it does give a bit more sculpted effect. So I definitely recommend trying this out. If you are fairly new to bronzing though, I would stick to powder. But if you want to, you know, if you want to up your game with the bronzing thing, um, definitely try out Clinique. Um, hope you guys enjoyed it. If you guys want me to do a review or demo on any other product, just let me know. Thanks again for watching, and until next time, <laughs> bye guys! Hey guys, welcome back. So today's... <coughs>